one of the Mickey Mouse costumes and is masquerading as a true Mickey. So I need all of us to be very alert for who might be the fake Mickey, all right? JC, Kooky. Because wouldn't it be crazy if the, the fake Mickey were better than any of us real Mickeys? I mean, well, well, my uh, God. Ga Gary, uh, I mean, I mean, boss, I'm just gonna head out to the boardwalk area over there and keep an eye out, all right? Okay, I, I don't want to point fingers or anything. But, uh, Your fingers are huge. I know. But I think Don confused. I might be the fake Mickey. Hold on. You want me to get him, Bob? I had it. I had Get him, Bob! Alright. Alright. Hit me! No, no! Don't hit me! Hit me! Sassy! Don't you tell me what to do. Please! You, you ain't the boss of me. Please, whatever you do, fire me! Don't fire me! Why can I never get that right? I mean, think of the time he's lost, away from his family and friends, frozen here, cryogenically, for the future. But where is his present? Andy, terrified. What if he comes back as some sort of unfrozen monster? Well, it would have to be some sort of unfrozen something because he's coming back. <laughs> With all of it. I mean, I'm confused, but I'm not that confused. <laughs> But what we could do, you know, I guess he's pregnant. What we could do, if we, we just sleep him frozen, and then we go, oh, hey, we want to take a baby, we want to take a baby, and then we'll raise the baby's our own. Once the baby's our own, what's the baby's our own? What's the baby's our own? You have woke me up here in my garage! I've been sleeping here for 25 years! Come on! God! Voluptuous! <laughs> and speaking for the whole Disney company, welcome back! Why don't you come up here and talk to me, sweetheart? I never knew that cryogenic goop could smell so delicious. <laughs> so I heard the rumor is there's a real Mickey out there. <laughs>